It's time for Scratch Nutty Adventure here on my Christmas Marathon Stream 2020. And yikes, this is a very choppy fucking point game. It's not even 30 frames per second, as you guys I'm sure can see. As I press attack, oh my god. That's the attack animation. Oh boy. What did I get myself into here today? Uh. Okay, happy holidays to you too, the leg slap of doom. Ah! <clears throat> <laughs> it's launched out of the tree, of course. Of course. You know, I should call it out this game was originally forty dollars. It's now twelve or excuse me, fifteen. It was originally forty bucks. Go forward on the ancient ice cliffs and bring back the first crystal nut. Alright, so here I am, and it's very choppy. Here's your attacks. Right trigger does nothing. R1 rolls forward, apparently. As you can see. L1. Crouches. And it lets you walk slowly, maybe to, to sneak through the grass for stealth part portions. Oh, throwing. Look at this. You throw nuts. With L2 and L and L uh, L2 and R2. What does this say? The Forgotten Temple. So I guess this is the world map and different stages that you can go to. It looks like we have an ice region, a fire region, possibly an underwater region, and a forest region, right? So it looks like anyway. Four statues, a ton of tablet pieces to collect. Okay. Timbo Slice cheered. He said, I love that beer you got there. I drink that here in Wisconsin. This here, the pecan pie. Is Cat home just in case you get so drunk you stumble out and don't hurt yourself? Yes, yeah, she's right next. She's she's in her office right now playing Yakuza all day. She loves the game. And Star Rune cheered. This game costs five times more than The Quiet Man for reference. Okay, then. Eternal Napalm cheers. I was talking to a buddy at work about Cyberpunk. He literally said what you said. Boring gameplay with confusing and repetitive side quests, but an interesting story. There you go. Hello, beautiful butterfly. How are you today? So that's the world map, I guess. Um, am I am I actually looking for like collectibles now at this point, or am I just gonna go to the next story stage? It seems like one of these open world platformers where you can do whatever you want. But I can't seem to jump up there. Uh, what's this? I have no idea. I guess I can't get that yet. That wasn't too shard. I already got a trophy. Collect your first shard. Wow. <laughs> I got a trophy immediately. I didn't even do anything. OG Brew 87 just sent me a dollar thirty. He says, Popli Oplio. Popli Oplio. You mean the Popli Oplio from uh, the Pokemon playthrough I did many years ago? Poplio? There you go. Thank you for the tip there, OG Brew. Um, okay then. You got an altar or something? What is this? Huh? Wall spring? Oh! Wall jump. They're trying to teach you how to wall jump. I see. It didn't do my jump. Great. The frame rate is quite bad. It's like... It's lower than 30 frames, even on PS5. What is this? A long time ago, collect a tablet piece. It seems like this is going to be a collect-a-thon game, much like Banjo-Kazooie or Donkey Kong 64, right? It seems like that's the case with this game. Not exactly sure how this is going to fit well into a Christmas marathon, but okay. <laughs> Did I watch the Ice Age movies? I believe I watched at least the first two. I don't remember anything past that, but I think I watched the first two. Oh my god, it's so choppy. You can't grab every wall. No. Hmm. Okay. 
This game is only four to five hours long, says Polish Frog. I'm glad I only paid $15 for it, if that's the case, because, like I said, originally this game was 40 bucks. 40! That's a lot. I'm glad I waited a year. What are these shards for? Uh, I honestly have no idea. Do you use them as a currency? Uh, do they protect you like rings in the Sonic? Do you forge them into some kind of a gaudy piece of jewelry? I don't know. Climbing. Okay. Uh, I want to keep exploring this area before I climb that wall. Papa Derek just used it. Am I missing something? Where are the glasses and vest? There is no glasses and vest today. It's the holiday marathon. I wear a nice holiday-themed outfit like a sweater and the, the Santa hat, and you don't complain. That's how it works. <laughs> you hover a little bit by attacking. I see. I don't think I have an ability to do anything here. Unless I could throw this through. No. So there must be an ability you get later to get across here. I don't have it yet. It's kind of a... It looks like an acorn, right? Acorn ability. Eternal Napalm Cheers. My cat Winston is going through... He's going crazy over a squirrel. He's trying to swipe at the screen. <laughs> Your cat Winston wants to get this squirrel, huh? He wants scrap. Well, my cat Jasper goes crazy now on stuff on the screen, too. So I hear you. Anything over here? Yes. Is it a shard? Yes, it is. My second shard. Um. Timbo Slice just cheered and said, you, did you ever wake up to your parents so early on Christmas they got mad and told you to go back to bed? Yes. Super Sly Gaming, resubscribed for four months, said, know you play a lot of these collect-a-thon games or have you ever played Psycho Psychonauts? You mean Psychonauts, the game? Yes. Psycho Psychonauts I've never heard of. But if you're just talking about regular Psychonauts, yes, I have a full playthrough up of it on YouTube. Beautiful Butterfly tipped me a dollar. I can't beat the Guardian Ape in Sekiro because the camera is dog shit. How this game even win game of the year? Um, it frustrated me too, Guardian Ape. And then, and then there's no. I'm not going to spoil, but it gets even worse than that. So, <laughs> so enjoy. Enjoy the nonsense. King Michael likes the Christmas sweater. Thank you, King Michael. Wait, can I... Can I wall jump up this? I don't think so. Wait, how did I get up here? Oh. Oh my god, it's so bad. What the fuck? Wow, forget it. I was gonna say, can I wall jump up the columns? I can't even control myself on the columns. So I'm not even gonna bother with that. <laughs> I'm just gonna ignore it. And we'll head over here and we'll gather some more stuff that I saw. Alright, I can't even come close to getting high enough to hit these yet. Nope. No. Okay. So I guess I actually have to climb the wall now after getting those couple of shards. I found two, right? Two shards? Unless there's another way to go higher up. Let's see. That's where I couldn't go. It's a launch pad. Oh, wait. There's actually two different walls to climb, right? Yeah, there's that one over there. And there's this one over here. Okay. Papa Derek cheered. He said, do you remember Zeke the Sabretooth? In the first movie, he was played by actor Jack Black. Yes, the Sabretooth uh, Tiger. Yes. Gotcha. Derek, I'm not surprised a lot of people have been copying you recently. Just someone copied this question. Took credit for it. It is very commonplace these days. What is this? Oh, I have to hold it. No? Oh? Oh, you have to mash it. Can you dig it? Complete a dig pile. They're sure friendly with the trophies in this. Then again, I think this is more a game for, like, kids. Cashmere Goat gives it a sub to Papa Derek. Congratulations, Papa Derek. Thank you, Cashmere Goat. And Star Rune Cheer, he says, 100% support you moving away from playing new releases and shit. 
and playing horrible shovelware, I think many would agree with me. It saves you money in the long run and can bring in the curiosity factor. I already know you'll say no, but food for thought. Thank you for the cheer. Tipple Slice Cheers, if you have plans to watch A Christmas Story on Christmas Day, TBS shows it for 24 hours. I found myself watching it five times. I love the movie so much. I would like to watch it this year. I don't know if I will, but I would like to watch it at least once this year. Um, Can Bar 2 Cheer, he says, Derek just asked whether you prefer a provolone cheese or a gouda. No, he did not. You're a liar. Okay. All right. So we're going over here now. What the? I swear I pressed jump, but I guess I didn't, or I did it late. I lost some health in the water, so apparently Scrat cannot swim. Scrat takes damage when hitting this beautifully rendered water. Oh, yeah. This is right there. <laughs> whoa, whoa. I think that might be a checkpoint right there. Maybe I'm wrong, but I think it's a checkpoint. Wow, excuse me. Drinking this pecan porter and getting nice and gassy. Getting gassy with it. Papa Derek, I am drinking. This is my, my I had a giant beer, had a normal sized beer, and now a can of beer. And I'll be having more afterwards. If you have a problem with that, shut up. Okay, let's continue. What's this? More box. Cutesy Woochies. Oh, scrap smash. I smashed 10 shark crates. This game is determined to give you trophies. This game is absolutely determined to give you trophies. Okay. The Woodland Valley. Four tablet pieces and one statue. Timbo Slice asks, do I give Jasper catnip because he gets his cats catnip for Christmas. Or cat, his catnip sticks for Christmas. They're going crazy over it. We have in the past. We don't regularly. Every once in a while, we'll give it to him as a treat. But that's something you don't want to do you know, all the time. These enemies will attempt to hurt you, so use your attacks to defeat them. Wow. What a novel concept. <laughs> wow. Really? Enemies will attempt to attack me. Hurt me. I've never heard of such a concept in a video game. I thought everyone was at peace. That's the whole premise of video games, too. To be at peace and relax, right? No conflict ever. I have 155 gems. I still don't know what they're for. Look at this amazing attack animation. I took damage somehow. <laughs> he exploded into gems. Dude, the game is so choppy. I don't know why the game is so choppy. Sir Spartan King, thank you for the cheer. Yes, we already talked about the KFC console earlier. It's not a console, it's a computer. Some health. Okay. Nothing special, just some uh just a box full of the gems. I don't know what the gems do. Almost 200 already. Play Scratch Dirty Adventure it says that this squirrel scratch could kick Jasper's ass. Jasper is not a fighter, he's a lover. So I'm not shocked that someone would say something horrible like that. And insult my cat. But you know, it is what it is. It's, it is Christmas week, two days till Christmas. It's time to insult Jasper, of course. That's that's in the Christmas spirit. Everyone knows that. So thank you very much, Play Scratch Dirty Adventure. You're so grateful that I'm finally playing Scratch Dirty Adventure. Because you're insulting Jasper. That's very nice of you. Thank you very much for that. You're such a nice person. Anyway. Let's climb. Checkpoint. Throw if I need to. Ah! What was the other thing? Was it dash or something? Yeah. R1 does this roll. This rolling dash. It's probably how you dodge enemies. Why is the frame rate so low? Even on PS5. This is shocking to me that it's actually so low on PS5. So many games have performed so well on PS5. The fact that this one is sub-30 frames is actually baffling to me. 
FBG Dunk cheered. He says, there's a Christmas tradition you do with your family that you miss? That I miss? I mean, my, my mom used to do a lot of things for Christmas. Various kinds of things around the house, decorations. Um, she used to make this pastry that was really good. So yeah, I would say there's a few things I miss. Or, you know, living with my parents. At the same time, you grow up, right? It's like your own traditions. La 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 la. Not this. <laughs> Woohoo! Oh shit! Hit the water. Anything back there? What's that? There is something back there. Well, I don't think I can reach it. Never mind. Not as good as a nut. I found a statue. There's a hidden statue of an elephant. And I got it, and I got a trophy for it. Okay. Wait a minute. Oh, uh, boy. Okay, that's not that bad. I found a hidden elephant and got a trophy. Okay. So the game does lend itself to some open world exploration for the optional items. Which we just saw. I just kicked the shit out of those beetles, right? Did I eat Panatone this year? Indeed I did, actually. I did have some Panatone. We got, uh, we got one a couple weeks ago and we ate through it. It was very good. It was actually the same one from last year where it was a raisin. No, not raisin. Excuse me. Candied, uh, candied orange. As well as some, uh, cranberries. There you go. Okay. Oh shit. Frame rate is so disturbing to me. The low frame rate actually bothers me. Like the game's playable, but at the same time, outside of a kid, like I can't imagine an adult wanting to play this because the frame rate is so so choppy. Okay, how am I doing with the map? Can you see the map at all? No. I was gonna say you check the map and see how far you are on the map, and I don't think you can. Uh, Derek, I do not think there will be any spoken dialogue in this game, from what I can see. What is that? Well, that was exciting. I got a shard. <laughs> All I saw were symbols. I was like, gee, can you throw and hit the symbol? Yes, you can hit the symbols. Very simple. Why am I playing this? Because this was nominated by viewers. People have asked me to play this, no lie, since the date came out. Which was like fall of 2019. I don't know why, but people asked for it, and I said I would play it during this marathon, and it was cheap. It was only like 15 bucks. Actually, it was the most expensive game of this marathon. I'm serious, because I bought this, and I bought um, the AVGN game, which I already played. So, this is more expensive than the AVGN game. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, shit. Scrap, what's your problem? It's the holidays. Jump further. Come on. Everyone, during the holidays, you gotta jump a little further. You gotta care a little more. 
right? You gotta go the extra mile. We have enough of this. You're, they're baloney. By the way, there's some nice woolly mammoths off in the distance. I wonder if they're supposed to be the main characters from the Ice Age movie or not. I don't know. Oh, you son of a... Well, I guess it's okay. I'll get this. Anything else down... Oh, my God. The frame rate is so bad. Anything else down here? I don't think so. Boy, it plummets bad, man. Um... Dollbox here said, is this whole game a metaphor for chasing a dream that seems trivial to others but is important to you? We are all chasing our own nuts. Yes. Hold on. Hold on a second. Yes. There you go. Sorry, I had to set that up. It took a while. Okay. <laughs> it took a while. <laughs> I had to play it off like nothing was happening. I had to be very stone-faced for that. Okay. All right. Anything here? And I don't see anything. Oh, in good health. A silver trophy. Unlock an additional health chunk. Uh, why? Because I got 500 gems, I guess? Okay. It was a silver trophy for that. That's odd. Okay. Derek says, do I know any other games from this game developer? No. I never heard of any other games from Just Add Water. I wonder how this game did bestseller of course it broke new boundaries in the realm of modern video games and we were never the same after this game actually so much changed mods of the motto says i'm a lot more fun on today's stream maybe because I've, I've had a drink and loosened up a bit you do realize like i'm like this all the time usually on streams these days i'm way more relaxed and joking around and i don't take things so seriously anymore Maybe you just haven't been around for a while, but I feel like I'm kind of like this all the time these days. And, of course, everyone uses the clown emo whenever I, I am like this because they say that I'm, I'm you know, cringeworthy or whatever. But I think people in general are like a more relaxed streamer having fun rather than someone being an uptight asshole, right? Which I used to be. I used to be an uptight asshole. I know that. I can't get high enough to reach that, I don't think. Right, you know, it doesn't, I don't jump any higher by crouching. I don't think I can reach that. Oh wow, is it a long jump? It's a long jump. You, hold, you tap and then hold, and you get an extra long jump afterward, which I did not know. Now I know that, I just figured it out. Eternal Napalm just here said chug, 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 chug. Thank you, Eternal Napalm, for the cheer. I'm not really chugging anything. God forbid if I chug, I'm going to get sick to my stomach probably, and it would not be a very good stream. Checkpoint. Very good. Wall jump time. Doink, 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 or whatever he said. Ah. See? How do I get up there? Can't. Can't seem to get up there. I took damage. There was oh, there was a beetle hidden in there. I didn't even see him. Hidden beetles. Oh, there we go. I broke it off of jumping off the ledge. That's cool. Well, I probably missed items then. Oops. <laughs> I probably missed some items. Oh no! Oh, poor scrap. I certainly didn't mean to do that. Is there any punishment for dying? I think I kept... Didn't I keep all the shards? I don't think I lost anything, right? So maybe there's no punishment for dying in this game? Huh. Oh, he's a... A springy... Oh, shit. No. There doesn't seem to be any punishment for dying at all. I seem to be perfectly fine after that. Oh, well. Not very challenging. Is it time for fall, guys? I mean, if that's what you guys want, I paid 
fifteen dollars for this, the most expensive game of the playthrough. Because people ask for it. People ask for it for a while. Coil Twitch Bot just did a hundred bit cheer. Thank you. I don't know who the hell you are, but thank you. Are you guys happy I paid fifteen dollars to play this? This is what you guys have been waiting for for over a year, if you can believe it. Yes, no exaggeration. Over a year, people ask for this. Are you are you very excited and, and satisfied with with the wait? <laughs> all right, how about this? First of all, Jackalise, thank you for a 22 month resub. He says, Yo, 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 hope you're doing well. Thank you, Jackalise. Good to see you and happy holidays. How about this? Oh my god. <laughs> if someone tips me $15 right now, I'll stop playing it and we can play a different game. It's up to you. <laughs> I know that's, that's sounding like a jerk, but. I, I was told for a year, almost over a year, to play this. I'm finally playing it, and of course it's terrible. I'm not kidding. Of course it's bad. I knew it would be. I knew it would be. <laughs> I'm just kind of razzing you guys. But yeah, this game is pretty bad. It is. Terrible frame rate. Insanely basic gameplay. Like, this is really bad. Look at this. They're all... <laughs> I just mashed the button and they all spin and sink and died. Oh my god. Oh my god. I wonder if I'm almost done with the stage at this point. Oh my god. Ninstar Rune Tree, how is this different from Bug Stacks? It's better. It's not. I mean, this is insanely cliche, low frame rate garbage. Bug Stacks is unique, has a great plot, cute, open world fun, not even repetitive, seriously, like, this is just beauties, this is straight up beauties, Timbal Slice Tree said, bro, you're feeling pretty good, I can see you stand without falling, what, you can see me stand without falling, what is that, what does that mean? Are you saying that I'm a wobbly bastard and usually when I stand up I fall completely over like I'm a wobbly idiot? I don't know what you're talking about. But anyway, people butterfly cheers at the stupid guardian ape for Sekiro keeps throwing poop at me. That's what you do. You, you open your mouth, you close your eyes, and you enjoy the big surprise. Uh, Actually, I was playing the angry video game nerd earlier and the, the, the reindeer were pooping on me, right? Disgusting. This is still going. This is still the first stage. We got a prediction going, although it froze on my chat, so I can't see what the prediction is. If you predict correctly, you'll win channel points. Let's see. What's this? I don't know what to do here. Seems like I don't have a way to interact with this. I need a way to interact with that acorn thing, right? How's my day so far? So good. The day's been pretty good, PJ Gamebox. I'm enjoying myself a fun, chill Christmas stream. I hope everyone else is enjoying the chill Christmas vibes as well. This is very exciting. You stand there and match, and it works. Oh, you gotta. That's right, you have to press the button rapidly. Another shard. Papa Derek Cheery said, I'll, I'll tip $15 to stop the game, $100 if you twerk for 10 seconds. I'm not twerking, so get that $15 ready. <clears throat> okay. Dalboff Cheery said, I got 10K riding on this. Don't let me down, chat. I don't know if it, actually there's a wager going on. I missed what it was. I actually missed what the wager was. Is it that we'll end the game? Well, will someone tip fifty? <laughs> will someone tip fifteen dollars to end the game? Will someone tip fifteen dollars to specifically request that I stop playing this? I've now been playing it for about twenty some minutes. The cascading falls. Oh boy! Wait, that was just the first stage. Oh god. 
Oh, God. Oh, no. Hui, what's my favorite Ice Age movie? I don't remember any of them. I really don't. There was one, the first one was regular Ice Age, then wasn't there part two was called The Meltdown or something like that? Where the Ice Age finally ended and all the ice melted and all the islands started moving and shit? I saw at least two or three of them, seriously, but I only saw them once, so I don't really remember them that much. Oh man. Oh man. <laughs> Doink? Don't see. Wow, that'd be a ran straight towards me. Oh no! Oh, that was close. I saved my own ass. Woo! Uh, beautiful butterfly. Cheers, Dad. Your biggest fan of Equilibrium, Haterbeam, and Peter Bidoves are here. Very nice. As well as all their sock accounts, right? All you guys are here. <laughs> your three biggest fans and our 27 sock accounts are all here cheering you on in your Christmas marathon. Thank you very much. All right. Play Street Fighter Five? Absolutely not. Absolutely not. This is what you guys. This is what you guys nominated. I'm playing what you guys nominated. You realize this was fan nominated, right? All right. I'll keep going. I'll do it. I'll keep going, guys. We've got at least another two and a half to three hours of gameplay on this marathon. We could fill it all with scrap. It's fine. I'm okay with that. I'll play the whole game if you guys want. That's perfectly fine. Right now, your actions are telling me this is what you want, so. Oh, God, what is that? A malnourished mouse. It's very disturbing looking. It's dead now. They barely exist. They're so skinny, they barely exist, right? <laughs> this is a scary game. Silvano Thumb just subscribed to the channel. Congrats to the Silvano Thumb. Thanks for, for subbing. I hope you enjoy all the festivities and things that you get as a subscriber. Very nice. Okay. Look at these skinny mice. Some of the, oh my god, excuse me. Some of the most threatening enemies ever in a video game. You just walk in a circle and mash buttons. They're very nice. Play Scratch Study Adventure. I'm not so sure that people are too happy right now. I'm just saying. You might want to talk to some people in the chat. They may be a little upset with you. You've campaigned for this game for over a year. I mean, I, I'm, I'm not saying anything about the game. I'm just saying. People are pretty upset with you. Okay. It's a very good game. Very exciting. Do I climb or do I... Huh? So it's up first. All right. No. Derek's is getting bored already. Uh, you're not the only one. <laughs> you're, you're seriously not the only one. Papa Derek says, are you aware the Silvano thumb is a detractor meme making fun of my fat thumbs? Yes. That's why I embrace it because in reality, I actually, I hate myself. I really do. I hate myself. So what I do is I try to do things that are detrimental to myself all the time in order to uh, drag myself down. I'm my own worst enemy, as they say. That's correct. Well, the thing is, we just need a checkpoint, which makes me wonder what the hell was the other direction there. If this is the way to go, then what was the other way? So now we're going all the way back. Simply because I can, and I want to make sure I'm a completionist. And I want to make sure that I get every item in every area. Because this is the game that you guys have asked for for so long. So we're going to go back here, and we're going to check this area out. Look at this. It looks like a bridge or something. 
Look at this. I already missed this. Look, I missed the big chest. That's very unfortunate. I missed that. Let's grab that. All right. What's over here? I said it looks like a bridge that's unfinished. What's this? Oh. I, I don't know how to get in these yet, so I can't do that. I've hit a thousand of these gem things. So this is just an optional area. Snowcrawl to me a dollar says, Never forget you can only please some of the people all the time or all the people some of the time. And then the game's perfect for a chill stream, which beer has been your favorite so far. Probably the first one. Probably the first beer, which was, what, the Scrooge beer? Old Scrooge beer? That was probably my favorite of all of them so far. Also, Benzol P2 gives it a sub to Dan Bullock. Congratulations to Dan Bullock on a gift itself. Alright, guys. We continue on. We've now been... Wow, over 30 minutes into this game. You guys, I mean, your your world must have been rocked so far. I don't know how you guys could ever move on with your lives after watching me play Scratch Nutty Adventure. This is just the epitome of excitement. Right? <laughs> this is what we've lived for. $15 well spent. Like I said, you guys took $15. <laughs> Stop playing it. Oh my god. No, we're gonna keep going. We're gonna tough it out. We're gonna persevere. We're gonna be troopers. And we're gonna I'm gonna keep playing. I'm just gonna not even look at the screen as I do this. I'm just gonna walk back and forth with my eyes closed and press the button. This is very exciting stuff. See this? Oh, I killed them all. Okay, good. Very exciting. Um, what is this? Oh, he has a stomp. I didn't know that. You jump when you press uh, square. I mean, excuse me. Jump and press circle. He has a butt stomp. What's that? Wait, what? Oh, you can take this out? Oh, look at that. You plug it in. So I can plug it into the other one if I want. It. But I need two. It's like ba uh, an acorn battery, huh? Papa Derek Chase and more people ask for Street Fighter V than this. I don't know what you're talking about. Actually, people have asked for more for Scratch Nutty Adventure over the past year than any other game. You may not realize that. Even more than Code Vein. Even more than Code Vein. I dare you to go check it out and, 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 and prove me otherwise. I dare you. Here it is. Here's the battery. There you go. We are. <clears throat> well, wow, Leaning Go Squeak is so upset by this game. He says, I don't even give a fuck. Just lean me and ban me from the strat now. I don't want to watch this anymore. <laughs> no. In fact, you know what? You have to stay. He's, st he's stuck here forever. I'm never going to ban. Leaning Go Squeak is permanently... Uh, he's protected from being banned. As long as I'm playing this game. What is this? I guess that was a statue. That was the hidden statue. Okay. Let's continue. We got much more to go, guys. We're only about 40 minutes in. This game's five hours long. We got a long ways to go. I'm going to actually marathon this game till the end today. We're not playing anything else on stream. It's just scrap the adventure for the rest of the night. Because this is what you guys wanted. No one wants it to end. Because if you guys wanted to end, you would have already tipped $15 to end this a long time ago. So, let's continue. Let's do it. Look, I skipped the... Ugh, I don't have to fight every enemy. Right? You don't have to fight every enemy. You can let some of them live. I mean, they're just innocent. They're protecting their home. You don't need to kill every single enemy that, that you come across. Here we go. Here we go. All right, good. This is very exciting. Romany Cobb says it was $40 two days ago. I know. It just went on sale. Like, no lie. It just went on sale when I was picking the games for this Christmas marathon. So I'm like, very lucky because I, I, there's no way I would have paid 40 bucks for this. I'm just being honest with you. There's no fucking way I would have paid $40 for this game. So, 
This is all made, made possible by the big sale. Timbo Cheesy, Code Vein is free on Game Pass. I hope it's good. I just downloaded it. Good luck. Good luck, my friend. Papa Derek Charity said there's a novel new idea. Do what your fans want and end this game without a PayPal wall. You already made over $300 today. I am doing what my fans want. People asked for this game for over a year. I'm not kidding. You think I'm lying. People wanted this game for over a year. That's why I'm playing it. And I would have to go against what my fans want to stop playing this. I'm serious. Like, I'd be completely going against the demands of the common the common viewer. And I don't, you know me, I'm a, I'm a man's, I'm a, a man of the people. And when someone asks me for something, I always, I always live up to to the demand, you know, the expectation that that I would do something that, you know, I'm, I have to play, keep playing. I can't stop. Oh, shit, that's my ass. Well, I made it over here. I don't know if this is a secret area or... No, I was probably just supposed to jump over here anyway, wasn't I? All right. Anyway, continue. Let's continue. Here we go. Papa Derek cheered. He says, A man of the people hasn't played a multiplayer game with people in a decade. Now, that's just a blatant lie. I played multiplayer games probably up to 2014, 2015. And I play multiplayer games every day. I've been playing, uh, I've been playing Call of Duty frequently. I don't know what you're talking about. You seem to be a liar, a fibber, a holiday fibber. You may, you may be a humbug. Papa Derek, you may actually be a humbug. Can you believe there would be a humbug on my holiday stream? Uh, Golden Nobles, Judy says, going to grab my parents' credit card, obviously a joke. That's right. Another running joke. People only contribute when they steal their parents' credit cards. That's right. AJ says, stop this in all caps. I will stop it. But I, again, I have, to, I have to live up to the expectations of my viewers, so... Oh, yes. Exciting. Does Jasper have a favorite cat toy? I would say whenever we put feathers on something, like feathers on a string or whatever, he loves chasing feathers around. Probably his natural instinct to catch, like, birds, right? That's probably what it would be. Okay. Fifty bit peasant says you're actually likable like this when you can take a joke and not ban anything you don't like. I don't alt-right ban anything I don't like. In fact, again, if you've watched my content recently, you would see I'm a lot more like this all the time. It's only if people are doing something that's insulting or uh like outright hurtful. And especially if that's something to do with my private life that's nothing to do with games, or if it has something to do with my family, then that's different. But there's a line, and the problem is the problem. The people who troll don't understand the level of trolling that's acceptable versus not. If you would just be silly and be about the stream, and stuff, I don't care. I don't care about that. If you talk, you know what I mean? Like, it's, it's, the problem is people don't have common sense. That's the real problem. Okay. Well... <laughs> uh, it's still continuing. I'm still doing the same thing. Oh my god. BWT! Just, just resell for 40 months at Merry Christmas Hill. Hope you have a good one. Thank you very much. Game Edge wants to be $2.20. Uh, just got off work. It's been a long day. Haven't been on your Twitter in a while. I've been busy using a marathon. How's the stream going? How's the games? What are are they and which one's your favorite? Even an Ice Age game. Damn. 
Um, we played three games. We played the Angry Video Game Nerd game, which in my opinion was actually really good. Um, then we played, um, Minecraft. And really, they didn't really play. It just kind of did tour of my Minecraft world, which I haven't seen in a very long time. That was fun. And now we're playing Scratch Nutty Adventure, which is pretty boring, to be honest. Um, it's been a f Oh, dodge this? Complete a level without dying. Now we're heading to the Glacial River. How exciting, right? All right. We've beaten the introductory stage and two stages. That took 40 minutes. Um, and we'll continue on right now. Um, Suave Super Mutant. Resubscribe for three months. Thank you very much, Suave Super Mutant. Papa Derek cheered and said, Can you tell us what genre you're watching? Well, uh, oh, no. I'm not even, do your idiot. Papa Derek, you know what? I tried to put up with your nonsense, but you can't, again, there's a difference between being silly and being stupid. And I've, I've, been, I've even done interviews about this before. That answered your question. And the fact that you want to bring it up on my my holiday stream means that you're just a turd. So I got to flush you. Um, so Spartan King, wait, now wait a minute. I just got a bunch of tips. I don't know if they're real. Hold on a second. Because so I believe people are trying to get me to stop playing this game. But I have to confirm that these tips are real before I do that. Because I haven't been confirming it. Now I feel like I've been duped. I actually feel like I've been duped. Steven Siegel plays. Cheery said, I tipped $15. Well, we're going we're gonna to confirm that. Hold on. We're going to confirm that. Because I don't know if I want to believe it. I think people are trying to mess with me here during my Christmas marathon. You know? We just got to be sure. So... Let's see here. So Spartan King did tip five dollars. Says when is DSP tries it? It's right after we switch games, actually. So let's add five dollars to the total. That's seventy-four. And then Steven Siegel plays. Timmy fifteen dollars. Let's see if this is real. Drum roll, everyone. Oh no. Unverified. Oh, I hit an extra time. <laughs> Unverified tip from Steven Seagull plays. We thought it was going to be good, but I'm sorry, ladies and gentlemen. Nope, I thought that was it. I thought we were, you know. I'm sorry, it's unverified. I told you, you got to make a verified account. That doesn't count. I'm refunding it right now. I'm serious. Steven Seagull plays, your account was unverified. You must make a verified account in order for that to stick. I just refunded your tip. If it's unverified, it means it does not stick, and it means that people can can refund it later, and I'm not playing that game. So I'm sorry. I, I appreciate that you tried to end the game, but it must continue. It, didn't, it must continue. We did not receive a, a $15 tip. We're almost at the end of the world, actually. Look at that. There's one more state. We're almost done, guys. You should have used the verified PayPal account. I'm sorry. All right, let's kill this bug. Let's do this. Jimmy Seagull plays Jason, you fucker, it was Canadian. I get less back. It was legit. It was not. It was unverified. You need to verify your account. If it's unverified, that means you can refund it at any time. If it's verified, it means that I get seller, or seller protection. So I'm sorry. We got to keep playing. It's not over yet. This is the fun. <laughs> this is good. Unverified tip. You can't stop it. This is Scratch Nutty Adventure. This is an adventure, and we're, we, you, you better buckle your pants and get ready for a full-scale, uh, epic odyssey of uh, platforming goodness. There's no way you can get out of this. This is an adventure over a year in the making, and you just may have to see this until I beat it. I don't care how long it takes. This might be the end of the, this. Might be tomorrow's stream. This might be. I might stream this on Christmas. I might be here for the next two weeks playing this. It's Scratch Nutty Adventure, bitch. You better get ready. It's time. I, I'm stuck. I'm stuck in a log. <laughs> it's Scratch Nutty Adventure, bitch. Who you think? 
Who you think this is? Scrat's a serious, a serious guy. All right, he doesn't mess around. You think you're gonna, you're gonna get him over with unverified tips and all kinds of, you know? What do you think? What do you think is going on here? All right, Scrat, he doesn't play that game. Scrat will only take certified funds. <laughs> oh my God. Scrat is where it's at. Scrat knows. Scrat knows what's up. Scrat does not play. All right? Scratty don't play that. There we go. We continue. Derek loves YouTube. Cheers. I thought the game mechanics of the game were better than Bug Snacks. Doesn't even compare to the mature immersive storyline of Bug Snacks. I agree. Dark Shadow Wizard Dragon Cheers, and you're more forgiving the chatters you know for a while, like when Derek used his parents' credit card, was it easier for you to forgive? He never used his credit card, you're an asshole. Cootsie Wootsie Cheers, does 50 bits count? Please make it end. No, 50 bits is not even close. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I told you. I told you how much the game cost. I told you what's at stake. Now? Oh, shit! Oh, my ass! No, my cute... My cute squirrel ass. Okay, now I can go. I almost died there. My two squirrel ass was bouncing and taking damage. Dalboss che uh, cheered and said, even Derek says he's bored. Well, you know what? I agree with Derek, but you know what? Sometimes. Derek says he's tired of the Derek accounts. I agree with you, Derek. The, the, the knockoff Derek accounts are pretty fucking annoying. Who do think they're funny, but again, they're, they're very, very stupid. They're the opposite of, of funny or interesting. I have to agree with you there. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are at 51 minutes of Scratch Study Adventure. We have found, we're still beating up these beetles. I don't know about you guys, but it never gets old. Just smashing the button and spinning the thumbstick. This is just exactly what I expect during a Christmas marathon. Very pertinent content. This is what people give me shit for not playing for a year. Really? It is. I'm not kidding. People give me shit for not playing this last year when I said I refused to play it. Steven Seagull places, is there a non -pay a retarded PayPal way to tip so that it's actually verified? Well, to ver oh shit. To verify your account on PayPal, you basically have to link all your information, including your bank account, etc. And what happens is PayPal will send you like a uh, uh, like ten cents to your to your bank account, and then you verify that you say yeah you sent me ten cents or whatever, and then it becomes a verified account because it means that you actually link your real personal info. Unverified means any Joe Schmo can lie and make up a bunch of fake shit about it, and it looks like it's just a PayPal account that just it's only in five seconds, and there's no protections for it, and that's why, obviously. It'd be pretty dumb for me to accept that, you understand? Grandma lo uh, uh, Grandma. Derek loves YouTube. Cheered and says that I'm, I'm nursing the beer and your grandmother drinks faster. I mean, no doubt your grandmother does. She's a raving alcoholic. But the reason that I'm drinking slow is because I have to focus on Scratch Study Adventure. Like, I started drinking this 50 minutes ago along with the beginning of the game. But the game is so riveting and so exciting to me that I just can't take my eyes off of it for a second. I have to keep playing. You understand that, right? Like, if I were to stop playing Scratch Study Adventure, that would mean that I, I I would miss out on some of these. Look at these shards. Look at this. And look, I could probably, oh, God, throw it, kill this bug. See that? Scrat her up. I wouldn't have been able to scrat her up. If I were, if I were continuously drinking, how could I scrat her up? What a riveting and amazingly good lock-on system this game has. Look at this. This is just very exciting. For the first time in the game, I actually have to use the dodge, it looks like. The frame rate's so bad, there's no way I could possibly actually like hone in and hit this guy. I just got hit. He died by me. Spinning bug kick. Silver trophy. Guys, come on. Scratch Nutty Adventure. 
Are you kidding me? This is the game of a generation at this point. Guys! I think I have to become a Scratch Nutty Adventure exclusive streamer now. Did you see that? That gameplay required me to dodge actively, to aim and throw projectiles, and on top of that, I do some melee attacks as well, and I got a silver trophy. Spinning bug kick. Spinning bug kick. Come on. You guys, how can you deny it? This is so good. This game is so good that Derek said, if I continue to play this game, he's going to go watch NBA instead of watching my stream. And Derek is a super fan. And he won't watch this. <laughs> he won't watch this any further. But no one will tip me $15 to end the pain. Everyone says, keep playing, Phil. Because we've asked you to play this for a year. Keep playing. This is what we want. Right? Oh my god. Did I kill them all? I did, didn't I? I think I ran away. Wow. Uh, oh my god. Whew. Derek Chase says, hint, hint. Wait, Derek loves YouTube Chase. says, hint, hint, dude, no, I'm out. I'm telling you, I'm tipping me $15 right now. Funny Maverick Chase, what's the worst game you've ever played? This game not included. The worst game I ever played in my life? Oh man. Uh, E.T. was pretty bad. Amy was pretty bad. Uh, but you know what? I'm going to go with the game I've never talked about before, and I'm going to be honest with all of you. You guys ready? Are you ready for this? I hope you are, because I've never, actually never mentioned this. The worst game I actually legitimately ever played was Lord of the Rings Online. And here's why. I had a high-end PC, and the game just wouldn't run on it. And I contacted the owners of the game as to why. They gave me all this troubleshooting info and none of it worked. Come to find out the game at launch was very poorly developed and would not run on certain hardware setups at all. So I said, oh, well, whatever. I never played it. And guess what happened? Years and years and years later, like three years ago, my password for their forums that I had to register for to get tech help on that game leaked. And that password was used by my haters to hack into a ton of my accounts. Including stuff that fucked me over financially. And I, I'm not even kidding you. Cost, I'm not joking you. I never talked about this. It cost me thousands of dollars. Okay? Um, yeah. Because those idiots made a terrible game that wouldn't run on a current PC setup. And then later on their forum accounts leaked. It cost me like $3,000. But that's the kind of stuff you'll only hear here on the Christmas Marathon. When I'm playing Scratch Nutty Adventure. Oh shit! No, Scrat! You gotta survive, Scrat. Okay, Scrat survived. Yeah, so you know, when people make fun of me and shit and say, oh, Phil doesn't know how to use his money. Maybe what you really think about is how many people fuck me over on a, on a constant basis and, and basically get me completely screwed over for money. Via various methods, you know. Recently, it's been the chargebacks and everything on the channel, but there's, there's been some many times in the past where people, like, I really hurt me concretely with money because of stuff like that. And I don't talk... Oh, God. I don't talk about it because I don't want to give these people any kind of recognition, but... Yeah. Yeah. Thousands of dollars screwed over. And there was no way I could fix it or get it back. As bad as that sounds, it's true. All right. Um, Ninstar Rune Cheer said, This current speed run for this game is 17 minutes and 51 seconds. Easily up for grabs. Derek loves YouTube Cheer said, Throw a tranny into the game. And those shills at the Game Awards would probably put it in the top five. Timbo Slice Cheer said, Why is it the game company's fault? You use the same password on everything. Um, it's not the game company's fault. But it's the game company's fault for, for leaking the password. For having terrible password protections. And years after the game being out, them leaking a forum dump. Right? It was it was basically a forum dump of their passwords. They're supposed to protect that information, and they didn't. I admit it was very stupid that I used the same password for a lot of stuff for years and years and years. But then again, I'd never been witness to that. I'd never seen 
me actually getting screwed over by using a password like that over multiple things because everyone else had been responsible except that game. So. Pepsi Pimps, this is my best stream in years. There you go. <laughs> huh? Uh-oh. It's a boss fight. It's a legit boss fight. Oh, shit. I think I just pissed the rhino off. camera. I just whittle down their health? Bloody adventure, everybody. Great game. Oh my god. Oh! There's a... Rhino entry. Okay, I'm done. I can't play this anymore. I was really hoping... Oh! Wait a minute. Someone just tipped. I was seriously like, I can't play this anymore. I can't stand it. The game sucks. I was really trying to hold out, and I can't even do it. I can't even make it an hour. It's so bad. It's one of the worst games I've ever played. It's so fucking boring. And <laughs> I can't hold character anymore. I really tried. Oh, my God. But I think someone actually just tipped to get it over with. Oh, never mind. It's an unregistered, unverified account. Never mind. Unregistered, unverified account. So therefore, it doesn't count. There you go. So I have to refund this. <sighs> Ray, 
But no, I'm really done with this. I can't do it anymore. This game sucks. I can't play this anymore. It's so bad, guys. Like, seriously, are you kidding me? That's one of the worst I've ever played. And I really <laughs> I really tried the whole thing. I can't do it. It's so bad. Okay. Mm. That's absolutely terrible. I got a fake $20 tip to try to cancel that, too. But it was fake. Um. So, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> oh, my God. A very brief break here. Um, thank you, Black Mage C Time. A very brief break. I'm gonna go get the item for DSP. Tries it, and then you guys gotta determine if you want Fall Guys or if you want um, if you want Fall Guys or if you want Call of Duty next. This beer is gross at this point, by the way. Yeah. So, uh, I'm gonna do a DSP live DSP tries it next, and then after that, we'll determine what we're gonna do next. Okay. Give me like five minutes, and I'll be back. Sound good? All right. All right, guys. <laughs> 